For decades, if you headed out to Lockhart, chances are you plan to get some barbecue. But now the city is transitioning away from being just the barbecue capital of Texas. KXAN's Tom Miller talked with the Austin Business Journal about the boom it's seeing. A lot of Austin suburbs have been growing for a while now. They have a lot of investment from tech and manufacturing companies, but Lockhart has been pretty much overlooked. Is that changing now? Definitely. You know, historically, Caldwell County, where Lockhart is located, has been the slowest growing of the Austin metro, uh, but primarily driven by the, the new uh, State Highway 130. A lot of companies are looking out there now because there's available land, you know, cheap prices, and a good workforce. And knowing that this change is coming, you talk to city and county leaders, do they feel ready for all of this? Yeah, so it's funny. The county judge told me a story about, you know, uh, about a decade ago, economic development leaders came in there and said, you need to do all these things to improve your standing, you know, with some of these businesses. And they thought about it and they said, do we want to do that? But they ended up doing that, you know, that included hiring a new superintendent, building uh, new roads, uh, the state highway, you know, improving their, their plating for homes. Uh, and now they're kind of ready to roll and, and shovel ready. It still feels though like a small town where everybody knows everybody else. When, when you heard from residents, do they want this to happen? Yeah, there's definitely mixed emotions. You know, part of what makes Lockhart great is that small town feel, you know, that charm of their picturesque downtown. Uh, so there's a little trepidation, but you know, things have been changing over the last half decade or so. But there's also a lot of excitement to, you know, kind of continue that growth. Justin Sayers with the Austin Business Journal. Thank you, Justin. Thank you.